Here we are, the day before the grand opening, and who doesn't like to start their day off with a little bit of off-roading and some makeshift signs to put in the windows of your vehicle? I love doing that. It's my favorite thing ever. Anyway, Roxanne and I are here the day before our grand opening. It's Thanksgiving morning, doing a little bit of sweeping, some cleaning, doing some last-minute adjustments before the big day tomorrow morning, and uh, everything went pretty smoothly without a hitch. This is just us enjoying the speaker system that we got set up. I'm obsessed with it. I have spent so much time blasting music in that lobby. Here's a little drifting Lamborghini for good measure. Here's another look at our incredible signage just to flag everybody down off the road and let everybody know what was going on. We had a surprise appearance from our good friend Juan. Flew in from Cincinnati to see us and support us for the grand opening. Love that guy. Here's the hoodies that we had made. You know, Roxanne just loves to show off her super cool pants and super cool boots. But uh, more importantly, look at that hoodie. I mean, come on now. Got ourselves a little mask matching embroidered jerseys, how to do a little dance. It's the morning of, we are on our way to the grand opening. And funny enough, this officer read the license plate off the vehicle and let Roxanne know her tags were expired. He walked out with handcuffs, it was pretty funny. I actually was a little bit nervous, but he was super cool. Here we have the Empress Elite Limousine Company. They're based out of Atlanta. They have super badass sprinter vans and they were so sweet and kind enough to come and visit us for our grand opening and bring one of their limos to show off what some of the things that they have to offer it was really cool really exciting then we of course have baked kitchen here they have a super good menu hamburgers mac and cheese chips euros food was phenomenal uh, they're actually a good friend of mine's from college had some really cool cars there it was really busy we had a lot of people show up it was a great grand opening i couldn't have been more pleased and there i am clearly very happy and of course this was probably one of my favorite cars from the weekend it's an old old Dodge Dart. It's a classic. They actually are coming back in to get their windows tinted. Roxanne's little nephew there. Got Alfredo backing up this giant truck to get washed and finished up. We had a whole bunch of snacks for the day on display, keeping everybody comfortable, fed, hydrated, just constantly booking appointments all day long on the grand opening. It was incredible. Got some raffle prizes here, the most massive bottle of whiskey that I've ever seen. And now we have the ribbon cutting. I want to thank all of you guys for being here for our grand opening. Uh, it's been a lot of hard work and effort. Um, this team that I have has been incredible, supportive. My family has been amazing. The community has been outstanding. It's been so fun getting to meet everybody uh, that's come through and gotten their car washed in the last few months as we've set up this tent world. Tent world Tyrone, Georgia is officially open. Didn't expect to give a speech pretty impromptu on the spot, but I just spoke from the heart and uh, I think it went okay. We did some post grand opening interviews. Thanks to everybody who showed up. It was freaking awesome. And I cannot wait to continue growing that business and being a part of the community in Tyrone, Georgia. If you live in the area, come by and see us. Uh, we're doing some cool stuff.